Hello everybody, it's Rascal Rich and you're watching the Fab Five collab. Uh, my hair is a mess today, so pay no attention to that. I haven't been out of bed for that long. But this week uh, we're going to be doing a little cooking show for you. And uh, I think everybody's going to show you one of their favorite meals to uh, prepare. So what I'm going to do is show you how to fix broccoli coleslaw. If you haven't had that before, it uh, is actually really good, so hopefully you will try it. Here are the ingredients that you're going to need. So the first thing you're going to need are two bags of the broccoli coleslaw that you can find in the bagged salad section at your grocery store. You're also going to need uh, two three ounce packages of top ramen soup. Uh, chicken flavor is preferred uh, by me, however you could use any other flavor that you wanted. Uh, you're going to need a quarter cup of brown sugar. Uh, you're going to need a quarter cup of uh, apple cider vinegar. A quarter cup of uh, sunflower seeds. And two-thirds of a cup of canola oil. Uh, that's going to be for your dressing. So uh, get those ready. Also, you will need to have three-quarters of a stick of butter. So one of the first things that you're going to do is uh, melt the butter in a skillet and uh, do it slowly. Do not burn the butter, but get the butter nice and melted before uh, you go any further with this. Uh, the butter is also almost melted here. While you're melting the butter, uh, you should uh, open your top ramen soup and crush the noodles up as finely as you can. Take out the uh, flavor packets because you're going to use those in the dressing and get those ready. So as soon as this butter is finished melting we're going to add the ramen noodles to this. Now you could add slivered almonds to it if you wanted to and saute that with it as well. Uh, I'm not putting the almonds in it today but uh, I have done that and it does come out really well so you certainly could add almonds. As you can see, I've added the ramen noodles to this. I'm going to saute this, uh, crush up the noodles. I continue to crush them up in the pan and uh, saute them until they're brown, not burnt, but brown. And after I get that part done, then we'll go from there. Okay, in this bowl now we are going to uh, put in the broccoli coleslaw. And 
empty those bags into this bowl. Then on top of that we're going to add the sautéed ramen noodles. So we've added the sautéed ramen noodles uh, onto the into the broccoli coleslaw in the bowl, and we just have to mix that up thoroughly. Okay, and we've also added in the sunflower seeds and mixed that into the bowl. Uh, the very next thing that we have left is the dressing ingredients, and so we're going to stir all of those together in a little mixing bowl. Well, actually, a big mixing cup is what I'm going to use and then pour that over the top. After you're finished mixing it up thoroughly, um, you can refrigerate it for oh, two to four hours uh, to chill it, and then it'll be ready to eat. And it is delicious. So uh, try it out. That's the broccoli coleslaw and my famous little ingredients here. So that's, uh, I guess, about it. Hopefully you enjoyed the broccoli coleslaw demonstration and uh, my little cooking thing today. Uh, if you haven't checked out the other guys' videos already, then please do that. Uh, I don't know what they're cooking for you uh, this week, but I'm sure it'll be something delicious. So check them out, and I will see you again next week on the Fab Five Collab. Bye.